All right, this should be a fun drone video to uh, to watch here. This is 22.16 acres, surveyed property in Fulton County, Arkansas. This is tracked 18 at the White Ranch Project. And from what we're seeing here, I believe we're parked on the, uh, the recently cleared site, which is about 500 feet into the property. Um, the guys created a, a driveway and a site, uh, so you can actually pull off the road and get into the property. We're looking south. You can see some beautiful pine trees. This is a mixture of hardwood and pine trees, and there are some stunning pine trees. Stunning hardwood trees as well, but we get pretty excited about those big pines because often uh, they're ideal for a log cabin, and that is about the coolest thing you can do on a wooded property. Um, on this, uh, on, on anything that's that we sell, and probably anybody sells, uh, after it's been paid for in full, you can cut the timber, you can build your log cabin with the timber, you can do a timber frame home, um, of course, you cannot cut the, the timber, but the mature timber, until the property's been paid for in full. Uh, we do often do written exceptions for people doing driveways or, or expanding a site, creating a site. You can contact us for details on that. So now we're looking south. Uh, that's the easement road you see at the bottom of the screen, the private gravel easement road. And looking southerly, there has not been any recent logging out here. The trees that you see on that are down are from... Uh, improving the easement road, so widening the easement road, and doing uh, the driveway and the site on the property. Looking westerly, property on the left, and I believe we do a full flyover here. This is about a seven minute video, so I think we're gonna get a decent look at the property. Um, it's over 300 feet wide, about 325 feet wide, uh, and then goes basically due south um, for quite a ways. Don't have the map in front of me, but whatever whatever it needs to to become 22.16 acres, I guess. Hard to see from the air, but some of those trees are, are monstrous. I mean, they are gorgeous trees. This particular property has a um, longer driveway than we've seen on just about any of the tracks out here. And actually, a, what appears to be a beautiful site so the the guys kind of um, removed the bigger timber with chainsaws, I imagine, and then they used a mulcher to mulch up the the small and medium timber. So what you're seeing on the ground there isn't really just raw dirt. There's actually a, a layer of, of mulch from the trees that were mulched up. I'm pretty sure they spread grass seed as well. Uh, so by the springtime, the driveway and the site are going to be growing up in grass. They left that one uh, nice tall pine tree in the site just to kind of make things interesting it looks kind of thin by itself but if you get down to ground level I believe that's a pretty good sized pine tree that they left in the site there so we're going southerly from the easement road the property slopes down gradually as you get to the site uh, it then continues to slope down as you move south and this particular property actually has uh, a named creek pine creek crossing over it so it's going to be a seasonal creek, um, not going to flow year round, but it is a named creek, which is pretty cool. So you'll have a, um, a real Ozark creek bed with all the cool rock features and fossils and uh, potentially arrowheads uh, that go along with that. As we go south from the creek, it rises back up, kind of, kind of levels off toward the center, a little bit of a slope from east to west it looks like. And then as we get more toward the south side, there's a, another large level area on the property. This video was obviously taken on a really cloudy day, which is unfortunate because um, with the blue skies as a backdrop, this is just one of the, the prettiest, prettiest areas that we've seen. The big timber out here is awesome. Uh, it's got that that great Ozarks terrain of kind of the, the ups and downs, but there, there really doesn't appear to be anything um, very steep on this property, which is nice. It's a big tract, and most of the acreage appears to be quite usable. Hunting out here, of course, is phenomenal. White-tailed deer and, and turkey. Um, we're close to the White Ranch Conservation Area, uh, which is about 6,000 acres of uh, public land that's generally available for hunting and recreation. There's a river that runs through the conservation area, which is really cool, swimming, fishing, kayaking, all that good stuff. 
So now we're toward the south side of the property and we've, I believe we've spun around and we're looking north. Oh, no, I'm sorry, we're looking east and if you see that cleared line that was running right up the center of the screen, that's gonna be the uh, basically the south line of the property. So there's likely some type of old fence there. So we're, we're basically directly over the south end of the property and we are looking north. This thing is covered with, with beautiful timber. And here we're just, I think, just trying to get some altitude to check out the area, but we're looking straight north over this property. The way this property lays, I mean, you could cut in probably miles of trails for, for hunting or for four-wheeling. Um, we've had several hunters specifically ask us for essentially rectangular properties so that they could create and clear out uh, long shooting lanes. So this might be a great track for that. But either way, it's over 300 feet wide, so you, you've got privacy in practically any location on this property. When you get down to ground level in that mature timber, um, you've just got a, a really, really private setting. So flying northerly, of course, and there's the, uh, the cleared site. It was essentially designed so that you could immediately get off the easement road with your truck and pull in it's well beyond any setback distance, so you could use that very site for building or uh, camping if you wanted to. By the way, the power is very close. The power is within about 300 feet. Residential power line, so that's awesome. Whether you ever use it or not, it's, it's great that it's available. So, oh, and there we go. So um, give us a call, send us an email. We would love to talk to you about this 22 acres. Complete instant owner financing. We're, we're always excited about that on this surveyed property in uh, the beautiful Ozarks.